Okay. Do 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 science. 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 Do 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 science. Do 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 science. Do 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 do. You done? Done. Hey guys, hope you're still doing well. Um, today I'm gonna be going over your stuff for April eighth. Um, I'm going to be going over the different steps of natural selection or evolution. Um, and then this should um, help you um, do what you need to do for tomorrow's assignment. So just to take a look at your calendar, if you have this out. Um, okay, I'm over here. So today I'm going to be going through the steps. Um, you'll be able to use these steps then in any notes that you'll take. Um, to do your practice with these steps tomorrow and then you do not have school on Friday so don't worry about anything for the long weekend you guys actually get a four-day weekend here um, but I'm gonna go over the steps with you I have this shared with you um, you'll have something that looks like this shared with you in drive so steps of natural selection um, I've tried to get my screen to do what I needed it to do, but I don't know if that's working. Um, so if you guys are okay with it, I'm just going to show it to you like this. Um, so it's pretty easy. Um, basically, what it comes down to is Darwin's theory of evolution said that all living organisms will change to be best suited for their environment. Um, and he explained that this process happens through steps called what he called natural selection. Um, and so basically anything living in an, um, an environment, which would be everything, will try to best survive that environment. So if the environment changes, those organisms will be trying to change. If the environment stays the same, those organisms will try to be better in that environment. Um, that's really what it comes down to. So um, the first step, according to his theory, is called overproduction. Um, I don't know what's going on. Oh, we're one word. Cool. Um, overproduction just means that more organisms are being born than can survive. So in this example, I gave you guys some baby sea turtles. Um, I said that for about every mama sea turtle, she will lay about 100 eggs per nest. And she'll lay up to eight nests per um, mating season. And of all of those eggs that are laid, so that's only 800 per turtle at max or somewhere in there, only about one in every thousand would make it to adulthood. And when I say adulthood, I mean the ability to reproduce, so being sexually um, mature. Um, so really, for every mama sea turtle, the odds of, even though she has all those hundreds of eggs being laid, the odds are that only one of them will make it to be an adult turtle. But that's what overproduction is. Um, the more um, a organism, the more babies an organism produces in one um, mating season is definitely an indication of how many, like of survival rates. So if you produce a lot, a lot, a lot of babies, not many are likely to survive. So that's why fish and turtles and reptiles they make a lot of offspring because their survival rate isn't very good. Um, but when you get into mammals, and they only have one or two, or maybe five um, per litter or per mating season, and their likelihood of survival is much higher. Um, mammals tend to take care of their young for a longer period of time, and so that is what is attributed there. Um, but either way, overproduction just means that more babies are born than can survive. Um, your next step of natural selection is called variation of traits. Variation of traits just means that organisms are born with different combinations and different versions of traits. Um, and so naturally, some of these traits are going to be better than others to survive. Um, I'm sticking with the baby turtles. And so in this example, I said that some baby turtles will be faster than others to be able to seek the safety of the ocean quicker. Um, and so this is just one trait. So we're talking about their ability to crawl on the sand into the ocean because the nest is in the sand and they have to crawl all the way into the water. Now, this isn't the only important trait for a sea turtle to be able to crawl on sand, um, but this is one of them. And so you could pick many, many, many different traits, but it's all about their environment. So the first environment they're in is on the beach. The second one is in the ocean. And so it's going to be a combination of these different um, good traits that allow them to survive. So again, variation of traits just means that there's different versions or um, different types of traits per organism. 
Um, the next step is competition. Competition is any time organisms fight or compete with one another or other organisms for resources. Um, these competitions will um, really be life or death. It's not going to be something like, oh, we get to survive off no food. No, that's not true. You, If you can't compete for food, if you can't compete for shelter, you will not make it. And when I say not make it, I'm, again, I'm talking about sexual maturity. Um, so baby sea turtles need to survive crawling from their nests on the beach all the way into the ocean. Um, they need to be able to do this without seagulls who are flying overhead, um, swooping down and getting them. Um, and so again, this is a pretty straightforward piece in this example. The competition is against the seagulls. They need to be faster or sneaky in some way. Um, with this example also, though, people are um, have put a very heavy helping hand in this to try and keep seagulls away from um, turtles getting into the ocean. But that being said, before human intervention, the turtles were trying to get there without us. And then your last step is the descent with modification. And this is just a fancy way of saying that the organisms with the best traits survive and they survive up to sexual maturity. As soon as they are sexually active and they are um, having offspring, they're passing their good traits on to their offspring. Um, the organisms that were slow, if we're talking about the baby turtles again, or organisms that weren't able to compete with their brothers and sisters or other um, parts of their environment don't survive to sexual maturity and they don't get to have offspring. So um, this piece here, I just said that fast sea turtles survive longer. This means over time, baby sea turtles have evolved to be born with the ability to crawl to the ocean from birth. Think about our babies, human babies. They can't move on their own in that way for months. However, baby turtles are born with that. They're ready to go and they have to, to survive. Um, so again, those are the steps of natural selection. I hope that helped. You'll be able to use both this video as well as this PowerPoint or Google slide, whatever, um, to help you fill out your homework assignment. Um, your homework will be to, again, apply um, these different steps to different scenarios. So each um, part of your worksheet will have a different scenario. And I just want to know what is step one? What is step two? What is step three? What is step four? Don't just give me these definitions. Don't tell me step one is overproduction. Tell me about the specific um, situation on the worksheet. So if it's talking about earthworms, you're telling me about how many earthworms are born in a mating season. Um, but it should be pretty straightforward. The worksheet's laid out pretty well. That will be due for you guys this Thursday. Um, so tomorrow, again, you don't have school on Friday. So try and get that submission to me. Otherwise, I will see you guys, looks like, on the 15th. Stay safe, people. Do, 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 science. Do, 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 science. Do, 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 science. Do, 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 science. Do, 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 science. Do, 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 do